Earlier this week, Clackamas's Jazzy Davidson received the latest accolade in the 2023 state champion's already decorated career, being one of 25 girls named to the Naismith High School midseason team. She was also one of only five juniors to make the squad. I caught up with her last week as her recruitment involving some of the best women's basketball schools in the country continues to heat up. Is it kind of a pinch me moment when you look up into the stands and see whatever head coach that you've been? You're like, oh, Oregon's here. Oh, USC's here. Oh, TCU's here. Oh, Duke's here. That's just another day in the life if you're Jazzy Davidson, who has quite a list of colleges she's narrowed down her focus to. Like eight schools, um, USC, UCLA, Stanford, Duke, South Carolina, LSU. Yeah. Casual. Also, TCU and Texas make the cut. She'd previously said she hoped to be committed by now, but is relieved she didn't hold herself to that. I don't think that was super realistic, honestly. I was kind of just hoping that I could have it over, but it's, I mean, it's a hard decision to make for sure. So I don't, I honestly don't really even have a timeline anymore for when I'm gonna commit. Jazzy says it's also helped her focus more on basketball rather than cram a bunch of information about schools into a short period of time. And that's exactly what the number two recruit in the class of 2025 wants. Jazzy's a very down to earth kid. And so with all of her talents and all the skills and all the hard work that she puts into her game, she's still Jazzy. Which means she's still as competitive as ever, even down to the number next to her name. I kind of take everything as motivation, honestly, but I wouldn't say that the rankings really impact me much. I don't really think about them, um, but I mean, obviously everyone wants to be the best player, so everyone wants to be number one, so yeah, it'd be nice. 